Today we possibly got the biggest hint about an upcoming DLC for Black Ops 3, quote end quote DLC 5. A mysterious DLC file was added to Black Ops 3 that may or may not be DLC 5, but it is certainly not any supply drop weapons nor a weapon DLC, and there's a huge hint that it could very well be a new DLC 5. I found something that suggests it's going to be a normal DLC like we've seen previously, for example, the Awakening DLC, DLC 2, DLC 3, and even Salvation DLC 4 and we're gonna get down to everything in this video so stay tuned but hey everybody what the heck is going on my name is Usman and let's just get right into it if you're new to the channel definitely do consider subscribing we do daily videos and live streams and in videos like these I try to keep a monotone ass voice but on streams we go full on memes so definitely do consider subscribing for more now I personally found out about this because the gaming revolution tweeted this out and here it mentions a new DLC DLC that has been added to Black Ops 3. Yes, it could be any DLC, but there's something, like I said, I found that suggests that this is going to be a normal DLC. So in this picture, it clearly mentions a new Black Ops 3 DLC. We got different languages as well, from English, French, to Japanese, to Arabic. Basically, all the major languages are here, which is something to think about. We also have a Steam sub-ID number, so let's go over onto the Steam DB website, and that's the website where we can find anything about new add-ons, updates, DLCs uh, for video games for the Steam platform. Now, if you go ahead and search up 168576, this new DLC gonna pop up. And if you guys are thinking like the Gaming Revolution made this up, it is definitely not that. This is a legit website and if you search that up, this DLC, the, the exact DLC that you guys have seen in the, the Gaming Revolution picture or his tweet that I have in my video, this is exactly what's up and it is on the website and it is real. So, do not think that this has been made up so it was on the website and this has been added on April 12th basically yesterday by the time I'm making this video so if Black Ops 3 cycle is over why are we getting more this has been added yesterday and yes it could be anything I want everyone to be neutral here but I'm gonna show you something that will confirm it's not a weapon DLC nor supply draw weapon but at the same time I do not want to call this a DLC 5 confirm in the title nor do I want to say it I just want to cover this for you guys and let you decide in the comments below but I will put this on for you guys so let's go over on to the steam DB website and once you search this up go ahead and click on it and I'm gonna open a new tab and here you can see three uh, CD keys but the license type is single purchase so we know this is gonna be a single purchase and this is a developer package which means this package is intended for developers and publishers only and by the time uh, I'm recording this like this has not been public yet this is for developers and publishers only. Now I'm gonna go over onto the Black Ops 3 app and in the DLC section we got 20 DLCs listed here and here you cannot see a single supply drop DLC nor a weapon DLC. This may seem suspicious but let me clarify this. Let's go ahead and open this up and uh, here we can see in the packages that this one was uh, linked with the season pass for Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. So when you buy the Call of Duty Infinite Warfare season pass you will get 1000 points in Call of Duty Black Ops 3 and another crucial thing I want you guys to keep in mind is the billing tab here it says store or CD key basically means that you can actually get a voucher in store like you would get a PSN card you can get something like that or a CD key basically you buy it digitally online on Steam or PlayStation Network or Xbox Live Marketplace so that's what this means and here we can see other stuff like campaign multiplayer zombie season pass awakening DLC and let's go ahead and click on Salvation DLC pack and uh, this is going to be really really important let's go over onto the packages and uh, let's go down there and let's click on Call of Duty Black Ops 3 map pack 4 now let's click on here and uh, here it says store or CD key once again it's a single purchase let's go in the depot and keep in mind that this is like the same this is basically the same except for the 13 and number 14 depot ID and here it says Salvation FF and Salvation in English FF which we do not have for this DLC I'm gonna click it and go in the depot we do have basically everything is the same and now when you look at this number it says 49 in the end this is a secret DLC that has been added and this is a salvation DLC and the depot ID basically ends on 46 and this one is a secret DLC that no one knows about it and it starts with 49 so we can assume this that this is after salvation which 
which is absolutely awesome. And if we go into the app section here and we go and click on the app ID, here we can see the billing type. We got CD key, CD key, and store or CD key. Once again, this was updated a day ago. So this can be purchased in store and we can actually get a voucher and we can purchase this online in PSN, Steam, or Xbox Live Marketplace if this is a DLC. It is definitely not a supply drop DLC. It is mentioned on Call of Duty Black Ops 3 app under DLCs. You guys can see on the screen, it was updated one day ago. And we have another one here that, that was updated three months ago, which I have talked about in one of my video I'm not sure which one but I'll make sure to link it in the description below so definitely check that out and here we got all the DLCs there isn't any mention of any supply drop weapon DLC or none like that not even a weapon DLC there's mention of personalization pack so it could be that it could be that but it is definitely not a supply drop DLC but let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below I am really really excited to see what this could be it is probably in my mind it is a DLC file but I'm not gonna confirm this until Treyarch comes out and says hey we got a DLC 5 for you guys but that is really about it for the video if you guys have found this video quick and informative give it a like and subscribe for more and I'll catch you guys very freaking soon